welcome to Urban Combat JKD. Uh, today I'm going to take you through some uh, form work and also I'm going to take you through some how to use uh, like a stick for conditioning the arm and also from that position to go into various different locking techniques um, for the arm. Okay, so we're going to flow into some of that. Uh, so if you don't have any training, if you don't have a training partner at this time because of the situation, the current situation, uh, you can make a little like a stick, grab a stick. Um, and then you can use this as a, like a, a punch, like a round punch coming forward to you and stuff like that. And then from there you can go into different techniques. I'll take you through it in a minute. Okay, but first of all I'd like to talk to you about uh, training on your own, some personal training on your own. So I want you to take your time every day and practice various different things, okay? In Jeet Kune Do, very important to work on the center line punching and also the finger jabs, okay? So um, I'm going to do, I want you to do a set of 100 a day, okay, center line punches and finger jabs, okay, go through them, okay, do them with power, speed, okay, it's very important that you do something every day for training, okay, so anyway, um, I'm going to take you through this, okay, so quickly, okay, so basically this here I use for, um, uh, it's like a stick, okay, so if you have a look, it's a stick I use for um, hitting my forearm, because I do a lot of forearm conditioning, so from this position here, it's like a haymaker, so if there's a haymaker coming in, up, yeah, <laughs> anyway, so that's going to work too well. Okay, so we we'll move on from there, okay? We won't do that. Uh, I, don't, I wasn't expecting that to happen. Okay, so anyway, so let's go into straight into form, okay? So let's, let's go straight into form, okay? So the first one I need to go through here, we're going to go through the JKD form. So from here, the right leg forward, facing your opponent, okay? So the first technique I'm going to take you through from there is lock cell, punch. Lock cell, punch, okay? So these are the techniques. Okay, lock cell is from here, you grab, it's like an eagle claw, you grab here, and then from there, you pull and hit, okay? So from there, you block the lock cell, like an eagle claw, so it's like an eagle, so you hold on to the hand, or the wrist, like so, pull and hit, okay? So from there, one, from there, two, from there, three, okay? So you're pulling, and hitting at the same time, okay? So I want you to practice that, okay? So if I face this way, okay, always with your right lead, okay? Now, I want you to grab, pull, and hit, okay? Grab, pull, and hit, okay? So nice and loose from there. This way. This one I want you to work on from there is from here is the parry, okay? So parry and hit, parry and hit. So from this position, as the punch comes in, you parry in here, this way. You parry in here. You parry in here. So if I'm facing this way, okay, sometimes from here, if you're sparring, you have your hand out like that, okay? This is like an end, so try and get used to this. This is like your antennas, okay? This is your antenna. Okay, you feel from here. Okay, this is where the chi cell and the rest of the bong cell training comes in, okay? You train so hard, that becomes like second nature, okay? So that's what I want to work on, okay? So from this position here, okay, is parry and punch. Parry and punch, parry and punch. If I'm facing this way, parry, punch, parry, punch, this way, okay? So as the punch comes in, there. And now I want to pack cell, okay? Lock cell, break, bring your hand around, knee, elbow. Basically, this is like attack by combination, okay? So using combinations to attack the person, okay? If you want, you can go for a low kick from here, you can go, boom, here. Yeah. So you can go kick, pack cell, lock cell, break, bring it around, knee in the head, elbow strike in the face, okay? So from here, if you go high, bam. Here, break, here, here, okay, this way, okay. So if I do it for you slowly, okay, from here, nice and slowly. So it's the kick, pack cell, lock cell, break, snake it round, you can grab his ears or grab his hair, knee, elbow strike, this way. From here, if I'm moving back, maybe for a couple of Finger jabs into his eyes as well, okay? So this is Sheikh Hedi, okay? Jeet Kune Do, 
attack by combination. This is what we use a lot, okay? It's what you've got to get used to doing. Okay, you can't just throw one or two combinations. You'll do four, five, six combinations in one to make sure you hit him and then just falls into place. Okay, all these techniques eventually go into your subconscious. Okay, so this is what we're working on. Building the subconscious, making it strong, getting your awareness up, quick thinking. Uh, this is what you need as a street fighter, as a fighter. Okay, this is what you need to go forward. Okay, okay so we're going to go through it one more time. Okay, so watch from here. Okay, slowly. One, two, three, four, five, six. I need to finish that. Make sure you go through it really slowly, okay? I'll do it at this angle quickly so you can see it, okay? So from here, right leg comes in, kick, packs out, locks out. Break, snake, knee, elbow. And then from there you can throw out some finger jabs. Two, or three, okay? Go high, bam, yeah, break, yeah, yeah. Best wishes, hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to like and subscribe, okay? Keep JKD, all the best.